this is Carol with Solo Cruising and More, and thank you for clicking on this video. I'm on the MSC Magnifica on a four-day cruise stopping in Freeport and Nassau. My dining experience on the Magnifica was so much better than the Maravilla in February of last year. MSC is definitely stepping up their game in dining. I had really intended on having a light breakfast since I got up early to see the sunrise and tour the ship a bit. So I had coffee and fruit and yogurt in my room. One of the free features of the Fantastica experience. I intended on keeping it light, but there were a lot of good choices. I love, love, love eating outside for breakfast and lunch on a cruise, so I headed out to the pool deck. And as I was finishing up, one of the solo cruisers stopped by and he agreed to let me put him on video. How many solo cruises have you been on? Oh, a lot? Too many to count? Uh, I'd say six, seven. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. So what do you, um, what advice would you give, uh, people wanting a solo cruise you know if they like have they're a little nervous about it at all or well the main thing about it like on this ship mm -hmm. and uh, they have 
the meetup, the solo meetup group, yeah. which is very helpful because you get to meet people that are traveling by themselves also, and that's a good starting point <clears throat> for the trip. Yeah. And you don't have to worry about being alone or, you know, finding somebody. Yeah. Yeah, everybody yeah. meets up and we mm -hmm. kind of intermingle and. Yeah, go around. Yeah, and yeah, yeah, like we did. We went around, did some shows. Yeah, we went around, right, yeah, right. and listened dinner, to some music. Yeah, yeah. Dinner. Yeah, yeah. So, so that, yeah. that really, it really, that's a good thing. And it I is. started solo mm -hmm. cruising with Norwegian. Okay. And they have an excellent solo program. So they, they made it easy, mm -hmm. you know. Mm -hmm. Just like the young lady that works with us every yeah, night. Yeah, she works with us yeah. every night. Yeah, that's how yeah. Norwegian was. Mm -hmm. And they did the same thing. The same thing. Okay, okay. Yeah. Let's see what other questions I have. Maybe. Well, so, um, so you would advise people just to just go ahead and book it, just if they have any kind of sure, especially yeah. you know cruising. Yeah, yeah, yes. yeah. Uh, land travel. I don't know. I, I'm not. Mm -hmm. In faraway places, I haven't really done a lot of solo land travel, okay. but the cruising. Yeah, it's just easy to hop yeah. on yeah. and just go with yeah. flow. There's lots of activities, things yeah. planned all day. Everything you have a you're in a safe environment. Right, you're, you're in a fun yes. environment. So. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, yeah, most people are in good moods, aren't yeah. they? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, really good moods, especially this ship. <laughs> yeah, no, it's been fun. This yeah, it's been fun. Yeah. This has been a great group of solo travelers. Yeah, we yeah. had an awesome group. Yeah. That's yeah. what I said. I said, we really yeah. had an awesome group. Yeah. Well, thank you, George, for doing this. Appreciate it. And um, I'm sure everybody would uh, be able to get some um, very good tips yeah. from what you said. Okay, thank you, George. You're welcome. Some entrees that I had that really was memorable was the prime rib, lamb, the grilled octopus, which I had tried for the first time and it was very good, coconut cake, and grandma's chocolate cake. And I'm pretty sure they just, they recently added this is where they have afternoon snack, midnight snacks, and brunch open on sea days. This morning we were heading into Nassau. It was such a beautiful morning. It was hard to go inside, but I did my best to give a tour around the ship. Solo cruising and more, and um, I am on the MSC Magnifica. Uh, we ported out of Miami. We went to Freeport yesterday, and today we are in Nassau, Nassau, Bahamas. Um, we're pulling in right now, and um, we're pulling in between um, our parking places between the Carnival Dream and celebrity reflections there's the carnival dream right there and on the other side of carnival dream is the carnival conquest and right on the other side and then on our left is celebrity reflection right there celebrity yeah
Another option for breakfast is having breakfast in the main dining room. The hours are posted there. As I was about to take the stairs, I ran into Christopher, another solo cruiser, and I chatted for with him for a bit. All right, okay, this is Christopher here, and he is a solo cruiser. He, so, he cruises solo this time. So Christopher, um, what made you take this solo cruise, MSC? Yeah, good yeah, morning. Yeah, yeah. I, I did. This is my first solo cruise, my first MSC cruise. Uh -huh. So actually, this cruise I booked second. I booked my first cruise actually next week. So oh. after we depart uh, Friday morning, I'm yeah. staying in Fort Lauderdale uh, overnight uh -huh. and booking a seven night cruise. Uh, we'll be going to the Dominican Republic, San Juan, Puerto Rico, yeah. Nassau, and Ocean K. And then since I'm already taking that cruise, I'm mm -hmm. thought I'm already flying down to the Miami area. I'm already yes. getting all the shuttle services. Yeah. So I'm like, what else can I do? Oh, so then that's when goodness. I booked the second cruise. Yeah. So. so you just did that on your own. You didn't, um, that your travel agent didn't talk you into doing that. No, you just no, like, oh just, my yeah. goodness. And then, yeah, booking yeah. back to back cruises. So. Yeah. Do you work remotely or something? Uh, I, I, I do run my own business. Okay. So I, okay. I'm able to leave because I have a lot, a lot of the systems on uh -huh. other people doing it. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, I like that. I like yeah. that. Well, how have you enjoyed the solo, solo experience? I think uh -huh. it's been a wonderful uh, yeah. experience and yeah. the, the dining experience with uh, five other people. It's been incredible and mm -hmm. nothing like uh, having a formal dinner every night and I know. going to. to the uh, world class theater and shows, yeah. and walking around the ship under the moonlight. So, oh, I don't know. Uh, oh, wasn't the moon beautiful last night? Moon last we night, had absolutely. a full moon last night. I know it was just gorgeous. And the first night was a yeah. lightning show like no other. <laughs> you know. Uh, oh, I missed that. I was too tired. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Okay. Well, thank you, Christopher, for my doing pleasure. this. Thank and so like, much. yeah. And um, if anyone has any. Um, questions about solo cruising yeah just put it down in the comments and we will we'll try to get back to you i'll i'll email i got christopher's email so i'm not gonna give you his phone number unless he lets me <laughs> okay are you are you single i am you're single. okay how old are you 36 you're 36 oh okay that's not bad you're still young <laughs> okay thank you christopher so now i'm inside again on five and okay, there's the Cuban lounge, Cuban lounge, and that is a scarf lounge. It might not be open right now, let's see, oh, but it is, nice. All right, so this is the cigar lounge. Oh, and they have a kind of bar here.
If you got any value out of this video, please hit that like button and please subscribe for more cruising content. This is Carol with Solo Cruising and More.